Morning, you know, um, this was once the economic hub of Milwaukee's northwest side, but as you said, for more than a decade, Northridge Mall has sat vacant, a retail ghost town. You can see the boarded up windows and the graffiti behind me there. Now the city says this is just too dangerous to keep standing. The city has ordered the Chinese investors who own this property to tear it down within 20 days. Mayor Tom Barrett made that announcement this morning saying this is not a real estate issue. It's about health and safety. Unfortunately, dangerous unabated code violations exist in the portion of the mall that is not owned by the city of Milwaukee. And the work required to repair the building far exceeds the value of the building. The legal threshold for issuing a raise order has been met. So that's the legal standard. The bottom line is the city has condemned this building and the former mall has to come down. Now the city issued the order, but if the owners of this building refuse and ignore that order and refuse to pay the estimated six million dollars to tear down the mall site the city says it will go to court to get the order to tear it down themselves but of course then the city will have to find a way to pay for it taxpayers could be on the hook for that bill we'll have to wait to see how that all plays out reporting live on milwaukee's northwest side i'm kent wainscott wysn 12 news